Alright, we got another young rapper, Enoli Chapa. This man is 16, but somehow looks 24. Huh? I don't know how that makes any sense. I don't know what genetics this man got, because whatever he got, please pass it down to me. Because if he's 16, I'm 29. What? To be honest, I don't even know what that was supposed to mean, but whatever. Anyway, he already has two Lyrical Lemonade music videos, one with Blueface. Blueface, baby. And he also got a new one, Camelot, so let's check it out. Alright, I guess we're getting a day in the life of Enoli Chapa, so he wakes up, does a few push-ups, puts a shirt on, goes outside and does some dance moves. I don't know what that was, but it was kind of smooth, I'm not gonna lie. All right, but let's just see what else he does. I'm a side nigga, and I love when she swallow. If a nigga say something, hit him with a hollow. They glizzy, knock your meat at your taco. Flexing on these bitches, they call me Johnny Bravo. School of hard knocks, let me take you to class. My bitch is real skinny, but she got a lot of ass. I love Alright, then he goes outside and beats some dudes up. And we got a POV shot of that. I don't know why we needed that. But you know, I always wanted to know what it would look like to get my ass beat. But now I finally know. Thank you, Cole Bennett. Thank you. And I also got it from Enelie Choppa. Damn, this is a treat. I get a lot of cash. If you try to take it from me, he's still gonna have a tag. I ain't gonna yeah. say too much when a nigga speaking on that hot shit. Alright, who hired these cops? This dude's literally waddling. How are you that slow? Choppa just beat three dudes up is walking backwards flipping you off while sagging his pants and you still can't catch him Fuck the police, cause them bitches ain't gonna stop shit. he said f the police because the bitches ain't gonna stop shit w well clearly did you not see them run <laughs> no 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 these dudes not stopping nobody opposition's mad if they play they get in pop quick flies nigga in the game yeah i'm a cockpit it on camelot Wait, what the hell? These kids are still selling their lemonade? Did they not just see what happened? Literally four dudes in front of them just got their ass beat. Then the cops are called and this guy is still chilling. Like, look at him. He does not care. <laughs> Whatever. Let's just check out his Instagram. <laughs> Wait, why does his shirt look like he's getting a haircut? Oh wait, cause he literally is. This dude's cutting his hair in the car. I love how this barber is trying to cut his hair, but Emily Chopper just keeps jumping around. So he's like, you know what? Forget it. I'm done. I'ma join in too. Imagine parking your car and looking over and this is what you see. 10 dudes in the back jumping around, one dude waving the Mexican flag, a dude in the middle getting his hair cut, and somebody's mom recording all this. If that was me, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna head out. Especially after I see Chopper do this. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. I'm, I'm out. Oh my god, Conor McGregor. Is this you? Sorry? Conor McGregor? No, no. That's not you? No. Oh. It's your ugly ass. I'm John Cena looking at that nigga. Taipan, big Buddha, and <laughs> why you gotta roast a random dude like that, calling him big booty ass? I mean, he is. I mean, but why you gotta, why you gotta say that? Why you got your ass? Look, he ain't got no clothes on. Porn, porn. What's the clothes on? No. See, this is how you get an old-fashioned Chicago ass woman. Chill out. Put your ass. It's supposed to hurt. Behave. And don't be throwing up some hand signals, DJ Ghost. <laughs> Stop. 
Now that's how you get your ass beat down. Come on, I ain't got no underwear. I ain't that's got how you get your ass beat down. <laughs> His mom beating his ass on camera. She don't care. This is some deep stuff right now, man. If this isn't love, I don't know what is. I need extra large. Yo, shit ain't that damn big. His mom really exposed him like that. You could have just let him buy it. Why you gotta shoot down his dreams like that? Come on. But wait, how does she even know it's not that big? To be honest, I don't even want to know. So we're just gonna move on. What made me go out was really, you know what I'm saying, how the beat came on. It hit, it hit, dun, dun, you know what I'm saying? I was like, hold up. You know what I'm saying? We got some right here. I had already like freestyle to it in the car. I was just like, bro, I gotta drop, you know what I'm saying? The freestyle was going crazy, so I was like, Gotta drop the real song. All right, I don't know if this outfit was the best choice for this interview. Like, you literally could have wore any single other color. Literally anything else would have worked, but you decided to blend in with the background. It's just way too bright. It's kind of hurting my eyes. I am so high that I'm talking to stars. I'm going off them jiggers. I'm popping them balls. I don't do drill, though. <laughs> Oh, he couldn't even say that with a straight face, but he's probably like the first rapper to ever say no to drugs. I mean, he does drugs himself, but at least, I mean, it's the thought that counts, right? I'm super hot like a frying pan. He said that he gonna take some from me. Hey, just know he lying, man. I'm a up from a hip, then blow like a whistle. Your bitch suck a dick like a Kool-Aid pickle. Your B suck a D like a Kool-Aid pickle. I don't think anyone in their whole existence has ever sucked on a Kool-Aid pickle. I don't even, I don't even know what that was before he even mentioned it. I seriously think he made that up. People in North, they were like, what is a Kool-Aid pickle? It's pretty much a pickle dipped in Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid pickle. You get fruit punch flavor, cherry, blueberry out it. Kool-Aid pickle. Wait, he's actually serious about this. He actually eats Kool-Aid pickles? Is this like his dessert? I might just Oh, the perks killing me slowly. Feeling like I'm Kobe, can't that nigga hold me. He the GOAT. If you the Kobe a rap, you the best rapper all the time. Kobe Jordan debate, Kobe. Kobe, Kobe, it is Kobe. Kobe Jordan debate, Kobe. 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 He doesn't even explain why it's Kobe. He just keeps saying Kobe. Kobe. All right, Anneli Chapa, can you tell me who is better, Jordan or Kobe? Kobe. All right, Um, why do you think he's better, though? Kobe. 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 It is Kobe. <laughs> Whole lot of money, whole lot of guala. Hit a party, 50 D numb by my shoulders. Nigga tried me so you know I had to pop. So many bullets it confused the doctors. It was just a, 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 what they call it, a hyperbole. Yeah, hyperbole. I got a little, ooh, that was why I used to do big words on your man. It was a hyperbole. Exaggeration for y'all that don't know. No way he knows what the word hyperbole is. He knows too much. He might actually be the smartest rapper we have right now. I'm kidding, there's plenty of smart rappers, I think. If you wanna run up on me, shoot them like Ginobili. I ain't left handed though. But I, wouldn't it be cool to shoot somebody with your off hand? That'd be cool. Uh, how about we just not shoot anybody at all? I think that would be cool. Like, with your right hand, dominant hand, left hand, and with your foot, I don't know, let's just... How about we just not shoot? I think that's cool. I don't know. Maybe maybe that's just me. But yeah, anyway, I got nothing but respect for Anneli Chapa. You know, he's doing his own thing. He's making good music. Again, this was all for fun and all jokes. So yeah. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.